As you already know, Catholic Schools Week took place two weeks ago when I was sick and in quarantine. So sadly, I had to miss the events and celebrations at our school, at our cathedral, and our parish that week and in our parish on February 6th. Since I couldn't celebrate with you, I want just to share a few points about Catholic education and our own Catholic school, Corpus Christi. Catholic education is an important and essential part of our mission here at St. Francis de Sales Parish. As together we grow passionate disciples of Jesus Christ, Catholic schools allow us in a very special way to integrate the truths and beauty of our Catholic uh, life and faith in a unique and profound way. Our parish does so by sharing a common mission of evangelization and works closely with Corpus Christi Catholic School in doing the same and supporting one another with our families and with the entirety of our membership in growing passionate disciples. At our Catholic school, faith is daily interwoven, not only into academics, but into every aspect of the students' lives. Secondly, Catholic schools offer a special place of encounter with Christ in its unique environment. And thirdly, this encounter with Christ is done in the context of creating a life-giving and supportive community in relationships. And finally, this is so evident when I'm at Corpus Christi for Mass and other visits. The environment there is truly one of faith, of support, and family-like, even in the midst of all the challenges of our pandemic. So I can quote Bishop Okoliak when he says, Catholic schools offer young people the possibility of a daily encounter with Jesus Christ within the context of the highest highest quality education. And that's what Corpus Christi Catholic School does. But at times Catholic education in our own Corpus Christi School, unfortunately can be a best kept secret. Since Corpus Christi is not located on either parish campus, we so often fail to see and experience the great treasure that it truly is. But the reality is, is that there are all kinds of good things that are taking place, amazing things. And in so many different ways, young lives and the families are being formed and transformed, not only as great students, but most importantly, in that formation of saints destined for, for heaven. So I'd like to share um, a quote from a report that I read from our Office of Catholic Schools. It really hits the nail on the head, as everyone at Corpus Christi School has made heroic efforts to keep in-person learning going while at the same time having to to leverage technology um, for the times that students need to learn from home. And it says that Catholic schools use faith, creativity, and good old-fashioned determination to overcome the largest obstacle in our lifetimes. We help students develop a moral compass in a digital world. And I really love this image of, of what our school has to offer, that is to develop a moral compass in a world that at many times can seem to have lost its bearings. So in closing, I'd like to express my gratitude for the heroic job that the principal, Jennifer Lewinsky, and all of our teachers and staff have done over the past of these, these past two years. They're all excellent and dedicated in all the time and love that they poured into their children and instruction and information. I also want to thank the parents and all the volunteers that do so much for our school and the the sacrifices that, that you make to ensure that this happens. And finally, I want to thank all of you for your prayers, your financial commitment to Corpus Christi Catholic School and Catholic education in general. It takes a lot of resources to provide this excellent formation. And because of your ongoing generosity, we are able to do so. And one last thing, I invite you to share the good news about Corpus Christi about Catholic education. If you know a family with children, invite them to look into our school. We're currently enrolling for next year. So thank you and God bless.